feels so smooth. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna show you what coconut oil can do for your hair. You see this rat's nest right now? So I just want you guys to get a good look at what's going on with this hair, okay? Oh wow, really? Okay. I honestly didn't even attempt to brush it because I just knew it would be painful. But I want you to get a good look at it. I have a lot of hair, like it's very thick. Um, and when it gets dry and unhappy, it is dry and unhappy. So I'm just gonna show you how I'm going to transform this hair. Stay tuned. So what you need is coconut oil. This is Nutiva Coconut Oil. This is the brand, um, one of the good brands that I like. It's organic, it's, uh, it's great. I put this in my coffee too. You can also take your makeup off with it, but that's another video. All right, don't be weird. So what I'm gonna do is I'm literally just going to take this. <clears throat> Should've brought a spoon with me, but I didn't, so. Luckily, I just washed my hands. All right, and I am going to take coconut oil, and I'm just gonna take a scoop of this, literally like this, and start and run it through my hair. I think I'm gonna need a spoon because I'm not gonna put my hand back in that jar after I just ran it all through my hair. Yeah, we're gonna need a spoon for sure. Got a spoon. So I'm gonna take some more. Oh, don't. Oh. So I'm gonna like literally just pretty much put it everywhere in my hair. Coconut oil on my dress. Yes! My hair is actually starting to feel better. Like, I can feel it starting to thank me. Coconut oil is like, literally amazing. It does so many things. OMG. I definitely will have um, more videos about coconut oil and the wonders of it. I should show you how I make my coffee. Ugh, it's so good. Okay, that's another video. Okay, so I have pretty much covered all of my hair in coconut oil. It's feeling softer already, and especially, ah, you really wanna pay attention, you really wanna pay attention to the ends. I know I said that was the last teaspoon, but I just wanna get more and just for the ends of my hair. Oops. transformation is about to occur. The great thing about this stuff is when you have it all like, all the, you're all oily and you have it like, all these leftovers on your hands after you're done with this, I literally just like rub it on my arms and my hands. And if you have a ton left, your legs. Coconut oil is delightful for your skin. What's up, Spike? What are you doing? And notice I did it dry. I didn't wet my hair first before I did this. I put my hair up in a bun with the coconut oil sitting, and I am going to leave this in my hair for about 15 to 20 minutes. And once I'm done with that, I'm gonna shower, and I'm going to wash my hair with shampoo and conditioner, like I normally would. Um, also, I washed my hair, like the last time I washed my hair, I usually do it every two to three days. And I believe the last time I had washed my hair was two days ago. So, so we're gonna see the difference. I'm gonna go away and then come back and I will show you how it looks. Hey guys, okay, so I'm back with my hair. I um, washed out the coconut oil and then washed shampooed and conditioned my hair like normally 
Um, but I just want to like show you like the difference. I hope I think you could tell. My hair feels super silky. It's not knotty. Like I could just run my fingers through it. Like it's so smooth feeling. And honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I uh, after I showered and washed my hair, I intended to come back to film right away, but had to go run some errands. So then I did do some running around, and so I had to brush out again. But like. I was, I've been running around all day, guys. Can we just do one of these for a second? I don't know if this angle is working out or if it's like showing anything. Maybe I'll put this on slow motion. honest and tell you when you wash your hair after you have okay what am I saying okay so when you go to wash your hair and wash out the coconut oil I'm gonna stress to you really make sure you thoroughly wash out all of the coconut oil because I'm gonna be honest I'll tell you what happened I was a little bit like in a rush washed it didn't wash out the coconut oil fully, like get it all out of my hair. So you'll notice when your hair dries, it dries and then like it looks still wet. And I was like, that's cool. So let me just wash my hair again. So then I had to wash my hair again. And then you like shampoo it and get all the coconut oil out of your hair. And once you get all the coconut oil out of your hair and it dries, it's just like, it feels so smooth. That is my, um, that's my complete sentence with Ariel. That was my how to make your hair softer with coconut oil. I actually will do this treatment, uh, I would make a habit of doing it once a week. If you do it once a week, it is, um, I think super healthy for your hair. Coconut oil does like amazing things to your hair, to your skin, to your face, to your body when you eat it. like. It's so good. I'm literally just doing this so you guys are like, oh wow, it does work. I should do this. Like, do I need to remind you what my hair looked like before? Gross. I have some more videos that I'm gonna be doing on coconut oil and the amazing uses thereof. So look forward to those because you want to see them and want to know the secrets of coconut oil. If you want to try what I did, just do those simple steps. Girl, you are good. And you've got silky, smooth hair. I'm literally gonna stop doing this now. It's just rude, it's just rude. So, until next time, please like it, subscribe to my channel, comment down below, comment, leave me comments, tell me what you think, tell me if you have better ideas for what I should be doing with my hair. Tell me whatever, just tell me whatever you wanna tell me. Tell me like how your solar eclipse went, because yesterday was solar eclipse day. Just saying, it wasn't that exciting in here down in Florida. Just leave me comments and tell me things. <sighs> Okay, I love you guys. Until next time. I have to stop that cheesy one.